there's this made big news this is a huge huge resolution right going back to pain in the asses and stuff not syncing up um this was enormous news to me myself and i but the tech world uh, more specifically android users windows users um this was a major issue file sharing so not only is microsoft and samsung pairing together to make uh the experience more better when you're using a windows pc and a samsung device but google put out a press release today and what do you know quick share and nearby share are going to merge that's right so if you're an android user you know what quick share is right whenever you uh share a file when you hit the share button you'll get a number of options right nearby share is like the very first option followed by your messaging photos app and stuff like that well if you're a Samsung user, you know Samsung um, has Quick Share, which is similar to Google's Nearby Share, but it's also similar to Apple's, what is it, AirDrop? And actually, Samsung's Quick Share works better, in my opinion, than Nearby Share does. Um, I can't specifically break down why, but I can tell you that. The times that I've and I, I try to use both to try to test them to see which one works better just over the years and more times it doesn't happen often but more times the file sharing would fail on nearby share or when I used Google's nearby share which is included on any Android device whether you have a Samsung a pixel a nothing phone nearby share is baked into the to the operating system sometimes nearby share would fail to uh, pick up any of my other devices around or it, when it would pick it up and I sent the file it would fail now with my experience using Samsung's quick share never have any issues it picks up my other Samsung device. Now, Quick Share was only for Samsung devices. So, Samsung phone to Samsung phone, or Samsung phone to Samsung tablet, or Samsung phone to Samsung laptop. It would be super fast. It would never fail to send the file, and it would always pick up uh, the other Samsung devices around you. Well, today they're getting married. They're merging. Uh, and this is good news because how it's going to work is they're basically going uh google is or i guess samsung is going to open up their quick share code and i think android is basically going to merge into quick share um so this is a great thing that means very fast file sharing uh it shouldn't fail that often and it should always pick up the nearby devices uh, this is huge uh, I've always thought in the past, man, I wish QuickShare would come to more devices. And there's a Windows application you can download, uh, QuickShare, Samsung QuickShare for Windows. So whether you have Samsung QuickShare or if you have Nearby Share, which is also available for Windows devices, I always use Samsung's QuickShare. Um, I believe the technology uses not only Wi-Fi but Bluetooth as well to send a file. So that's why typically, I believe it'll fall back on whichever option is faster or has the better connection in Samsung QuickShare. Um, but this is good news. Uh, this is really good news. Let's see, I'm gonna put this press release down at the uh, in the description box as well. I wanna see when they are, I had to go live uh, and I could not see when they were going to, I know they announced it today, but I don't know when it is going to actually be available uh, next month. Check this out. QuickShare will start rolling out to current nearby share enabled devices next month. So there's nothing you have to do. You don't have to update your phone. You don't even have to update your app. This will be done in the background automatically. But over the next few weeks, just keep an eye on your nearby share. It's gonna get a new name, QuickShare, and it'll get a new icon. 
Uh, where is it? It is, it's gonna look like this right here. It's gonna be the little circle with the arrows pointing to the middle. Very, very, very good news. Man, I'm, oh, it's gonna look like this, the blue right there. It's gonna look like that. Oh man, this is music to our ears. You can also uh, send files to and from a TV. Anything running Android. This will work with uh, a Android phone, any Android phone, any Windows computer, any Chromebook, because they run Chrome OS, it'll work with that as well. Um, and any uh, Google TV devices as well. So anything running Android, phone, computer, tablet, TV, um, it'll work. So this is just another iteration of Android evolving, right? There's no sense in having two separate quick share things. This was only a matter of time before they merged and uh, very good news.